As we get ready for that potential severe weather later today, we want to make sure you're ready in case you have a weather emergency. Lindsay Stone joins us live downtown with where to go and who to call. Morning, Lindsay. Good morning to you. Emergency services are reminding all of us to have a plan and be weather aware today. Now, as Jim's been saying, that main time of concern between 8 p.m. and 2 a.m. later today. But again, that cause or potential for severe weather could be happening all day long. So we want to make sure that you have a plan to stay safe. So as that weather is changing, it's important to make sure that you have a way that you can get those alerts in real time for an emergency. That includes our Weather Authority app with Fox 59, or make sure you have a weather radio close by. Now, if a tornado warning is issued, have a designated safety spot. Take a good look at your screen right now. This graphic is going to show you where to go and where not to go. So a spot that you should go should be an interior room with no windows, preferably in the basement if you have one. You also want to make sure and grab your emergency kit, which should have things like water, phone chargers, batteries, a flashlight, even a pair of shoes. And that's one tip my dad has always told me growing up. Now, it is scary to think about, but if you do experience it's an emergency. We want to make sure you know who to call. So residents should call in Marion County, should call the Mayor's Action Center if they're experiencing high water on the roadways or debris in streets. We're going to have that number right there on your screen for you. Now, if you notice any fallen power lines or are experiencing power outages, call AES. That number also on your screen. It's 317-261-8111. And we're also going to have more resources on our website, including additional numbers to call with more tips on creating your emergency plan. Now, we are are the Weather Authority app, Jim, keeping us up to speed on what exactly is happening. Again, we have more tips on how to stay safe, but make sure you're planning ahead and your entire household knows that plan so you can stay safe today and throughout the rest of the evening. Reporting downtown, Lindsay Stone, Fox 59 News. Thanks so much.